Hey guys, welcome to the range today, and today I'm going to be shooting my 1522, that Smith and, we Smith and Wesson M&P that uh, you saw me put the Val Quartzen uh, extractor in. Uh, I'm going to be going ahead and putting some rounds through it, uh, different types, to see if that actually uh, did any good or not. Um, and sorry, it's a little windy out here, so uh, you got to bear with me here, but. Uh, uh, these are some of the rounds that I'm going to be putting in there. Uh, this is some uh, Federal Auto Match uh, 22 long rifle, of course. Uh, and then we've got some uh, Mini Mag CCI. Uh, they're hollow points. Uh, then we're going to put in some Remington 22 Golden Bullet and see how that goes. Last time uh, before I put the Valcourts in, I had a couple of uh, misfires. Um, so. Uh, Hopefully, uh, cross my fingers, we're going to uh, actually cross them, not put them up like this. Um, it'll work. Then uh, I got some Aguila, or Aguila, I'm not sure how you say that, but uh, this is 22 uh, Super Extra Hollow Point. Uh, all these are high velocity. Um, this one's like 28, uh, well actually 1280 feet per second. Um, so uh, hopefully they're going to work, and then I've got some mystery ammo. I think this is federal stuff. Uh, this is like I got this like 40 years ago. I didn't, but my grandpa got this uh, 40 years ago uh, when he got a little 22 uh, back in the day. So I'm gonna go ahead and shoot this and see if this actually uh, will cycle through my weapon. And if it does, that Val uh, extractor is the you know what the the sh it because uh, yeah this I I haven't been able to cycle this through any of my weapons. So uh, we'll go ahead and see. I'm going to shoot down range and you'll see if, uh, if, if it goes or not. So stay tuned. Again guys, these are CCI mini mags so this should perform like I expect it to, which is a good high quality round and shouldn't have any uh, failure to fires or anything like that. So let's go ahead and do what we need to do. All right. Okay, looks good to go. Take it off safety. And I think we are ready to fire. All right, cool. Ejection port open. No uh, failure to fires or anything like that. That is a, I should be expected though, like I said, that was good quality rounds. So I'm gonna go ahead and load in the next round uh, choice and uh, we'll see if that one fires. And this is a little lower quality in my book, but uh, we'll, we'll see. So give me a second. All right guys. So the next round I'm using is this uh, Aguila, I don't know how you say that, Aguila uh, 22 Super Extra Hollow Point. And it, uh, uh, let's see, it is about 1,280 feet per second. There we go, I don't know if you can see that. Uh, and don't get all butt hurt if uh, you use this round, and I'm calling it a little substandard compared to the CCI. Uh, I think it's probably just about as good, but um, I use CCI mini mags uh, and I've used them forever and they've been awesome, never had a problem. So like I said, uh, I, I think this is just a little little uh, below that, but uh, we'll see. So um, let me load it up in the, the gun and we'll try this one. All right, here we go. Locked and loaded, off fire.
All right, got through that full magazine and bolt open and the magazine empty. So that's another win. Cool. All right, that extractor seems to be good so far. Let's try the let's try uh, the next round. Okay, now we're gonna try Federal 22 long rifle uh, auto match, and this stuff is 40 grain. And it looks like it has a velocity of the muzzle velocity of uh, uh, 1200 feet per second. So let's go ahead and try this. Okay, chamber empty. Load her up. Bolt release. Bam. Take her off the fire. Gotta adjust my red dot. It's getting a little sunny outside, so I gotta make it a little brighter. All right, let's keep going. Wait, all right, that's all good to go too. On to the next round, because uh, all these are going through. Woo! Okay, now we're going for the Remington Golden Bullet, which is a, of course, high velocity round, and it is a uh, plated round nose. And it uh, has a velocity of 1255, so on to this one. And I've had kind of bad luck with this stuff, so if it goes through this, I'm good. All right, let's send this downrange. Okay, keep it on fire. Wait, all the way through. Very impressed. Very impressed indeed. Doing exactly what I wanted it to do. All right, on to the next, and this is the last. And this is that 40-year-old uh, stuff that I got from my uh, grandpa. Uh, you're gonna like this. I, I'm not, I definitely am not sure if this stuff is gonna uh, fire or not, but uh, let's get to it. All right, guys, I got this stuff loaded in my uh, magazine, and uh, it looks like the manufacturer is, is federal. Like I said, it's 40 years old, but I made sure that nothing was corroded, as you can tell, or maybe you can't, but I made sure it was in good condition. It surely is uh, getting my fingers all leaded up here. Um, but like I said, it's for 40 years old, I've kept it, or my grandparents did, kept them in... Uh, a nice uh, sealed container so it looks to be in pretty good condition so I'm gonna go ahead and shoot it let's see I'm not guarantee anything but boy if it shoots this stuff uh, without any uh, failures that Volkhorts and uh, extractor is mother awesome okay so let's go shoot it all right magazine in let's go ahead and do the bolt catch or release take it off of uh, fire and let's do this see if this baby will shoot it <laughs> I 
Oh my god, it just blew up everything. Oh my. No, I'm just kidding. Let's keep going. Aha! All the way through. That is freaking awesome. I cannot believe it. Wow. All right, well, I'm pretty happy. That full quartz and uh, extractor worked exactly like it should. Uh, if you don't have one in your gun, you need to get it for this. It is, it is awesome. Even if it's working right like mine was, um, it did have a couple of uh, failure to ejects. Uh, so, uh, and it's, I mean, it's just, uh, it's bulletproof now. So, yeah, get one. It, I mean, you just, you can't beat them. It'll eat up anything that you put in this thing now. Ah, unless you drop your magazine like that. So, uh, if you like this little content, give me a thumbs up. And uh, subscribe, of course. And I will see you on the next one, guys. This is Hursty and the Hursty's Garage plus guns out peace all right guys and if you're wondering this is the target I was shooting at and look at that crap uh, bunch of junk bunch of junk uh, don't don't take me shooting because I can't shoot worth of crap um, actually I'm still sighting in my uh, red dot but yeah, this is the crap that I was shooting at. Just for fun. So, see you in the next one.